Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is Sean Ford. I'm the Chief Operating Officer of Algorand, which is a next generation blockchain that was founded by uh, Turing Award winner Silvio McCalley and uh, has really started to um, break down a number of the barriers that have gotten in the way of broad adoption and uh, broad use and application of what we think is a revolutionary uh, piece of technology that can disrupt a number of industries in the ways companies interact with uh, each other and with their users. That brings me to the excitement of the day today, which is to uh, talk to Mario Casaraghi, who is the Chief Strategy Officer for Exponite. And um, I'll let Mario talk a bit about Exponite, but it is one of the sort of testaments, I think, to the potential for blockchain technology with a company like Exponite that is incredibly forward-leaning and uh, tech forward as it thinks about redefining itself and how it works with its users. So uh, without further ado, Mario, welcome. It's great to have you. Thank you so much. Well, my name is Mario Kaziragi. I'm the Chief of Strategy of Exponite, as Sean mentioned. Uh, I have a past in, uh, uh, in the financial markets, in investment banking. I transitioned to, to blockchain in 2016 uh, with a few exciting projects and I've been, <clears throat> as a co-founder and, and Chief of Strategy of Exponite, I've been working on this for the past two and a half years, uh, which have been ex extremely exciting and we're now ready to hit the market and we've selected, we've, we've selected the partners and we've partnered up with um, established companies and we are really excited to launch on the Argolon blockchain. I can introduce Exonite. Exonite yes. is a, a um, blockchain-based entertainment platform that wants to um, create a new ecosystem of uh, uh, inclusiveness where users are not treated as commodities like often happen, like it often happens in the digital space, but are really partner to uh, to what we do and to the success, and they participate to the success of the platform and of the ecosystem. And so, we really treat uh, users as partners, and uh, we share with them the economic and uh, ecosystem success of our platform. So that's how we see um, our ecosystem. That's great. So one of the things when I've read about Exponite and um, and that we've spoken about previously is just that point, which is the importance for content creators and publishers, people who build all sorts of, of, of types of content, um, are really looking for ways to deepen the relationship that they have with their users and create uh, opportunities that appropriately recognize the contribution that the users are actually making to the success of the company. That seems to be at the heart of what Exponite is pursuing here, um, but I would be curious to hear your reaction to that. No, and absolutely, and this is one of the main reasons why we decided to implement blockchain technology because it allows for this intermediation of different markets and as well as um, the creation of, of direct relationships between various stakeholders. In, in this particular context, we have uh, obviously the users at the center of our ecosystem, content creators and content owners, as well as advertisers, uh, and we'll go into the business model of what we're doing, but we basically reduce the barriers between uh, between each other, and we allow them to directly uh, directly engage with each other, sharing and exchanging value as well as sharing and exchanging data, without long chain of intermediaries like, for example, happens in the digital advertising space, where uh, the where the business models that are out there now are prone for disruptions. They've been there for a decade now, and they're really dominated by very strong dominant uh, players. So that, that's how we see uh, the, where we're going. And, and so thanks to blockchain and tokenization, these, these relationships become, become direct. Uh, you, you allow different stakeholders to uh, interact with each other without a party in between. But with the decentralized system, the blockchain allow you to allows you to implement. So, Mario, maybe what we might make sense to do is to step back a little bit and talk about Exfinite 
and the vision that Exponite has on its journey to sort of build these opportunities for users and, and build a deeper relationship uh, with the, the millions of, of uh, users that you actually have currently. Yeah, thank you, Sean. So Exponite is a technology company that is develop, developing blockchain technology uh, with the concept of financial inclusiveness and direct really, and creating that relationship with stakeholders, as we discussed. We have just launched our first DAP or decentralized application, which is called Mazalo, focused on the Southeast Asian region. Uh, really, the business model is an advertising, advertising video on demand platform with premium content so we're a sort of blue ocean strategy between the current business models where on one side you have uh, subscription video on demand models like netflix and on the other side you have advertisement video on demand model like youtube what we allow is for premium content to, to be delivered to the masses uh, for free and on top of that uh, we actually create this reward reward based economy where we've, we're creating algorithms to give a value to the value that users bring to us, which is their attention, their data, and their social networks, and sharing part of this back to them. We uh, have uh, significant partnerships in place, so the, the, uh, the platform has been launched on the back of a partnership with uh, Eros Now, which is the largest uh, uh, Bollywood studio. You know, they've been in operation since the late the 80s. They own mm, around 50,000 hours of premium content. And we have uh, exclusive rights uh, for their digital library, as well as access to their 260 million registered users. Uh, so we, we really have the opportunity to tap into uh, a community that has already engaged with the content, but is currently not monetized. Extending the relation, extending the relationship of Eros towards their users and creating a strong relationship between Mazalo and Eros. That's great. And so, and it, I, I understand, you know, Eros is certainly an impressive organization uh, to have that relationship with. And, you know, I think as a testament to the business model that you're describing, there are a number of other fairly significant partners that you have that you're working with to make this something that uh, people will be able to experience. Yeah, absolutely. So again, we are trying to create an ecosystem. So Xfinite is bringing through Mazalo in this case, the blockchain services to other partners. And in this case, we have already secured and announced partnership with Daily Hunt, which has just become a unicorn. Uh, which has 280 million monthly active users. It's a news aggregator, so what people do in the, in the, in the first 30 minutes of their morning, uh, where we provide them with our content and with our reward-based economy, basically extending our ecosystem externally to only the Mazal platform. We have also a similar partnership with SpiceJet, which is a budget airlines uh, in the Southeast Asian region, um, obviously majorly in India, uh, that has around 60 million day, uh, month, uh, yearly travelers, uh, where we provide offline entertainment and the rewards economy to them as well. We are also a Microsoft scale-up company, so Microsoft has helped us significantly, significantly to grow so far. Our company started in 2018, as I said, and we, we grew from five people to 50. So the, the sheer size of the potential opportunity is a little bit hard to grasp because it is so so big. And I guess the, the question would be, you know, um, why or after going through the process that you did, you know, why did you come to Algorand? And what, what, was, uh, what was it about yeah. Algorand that really helped uh, you feel like you could, could make this vision a reality? No, so Algorand is, uh, uh, well, first of all, an amazing team of professionals of, on the technology side and on the business side as well. So we've enjoyed greatly working together so far. But the major point was that we are a mass adoption play. We just talked about the numbers that we're talking about. And as, you know, as common knowledge, one of the major problems of blockchain today is scalability and costs. So we really set off on a journey to try to look for the best technology to cater for mass adoption. 
and we have identified Algorand as the best possible technology right now in the market, but also given the skills and the drive to move forward that Algorand has, also prospectively in the future, we expect Algorand to be um, the best technology to do what we do. That's great. Thank you. And uh, thank you for, for that too. And I think um, in terms of what's next and what's coming for, for this project, maybe share a little bit about um, your plans and your timelines for ramping this up and, and growing the opportunity. Yeah, absolutely. So firstly, Mazalo is uh, out. Uh, so the platform is live uh, since uh, a couple of months. Uh, we've already gotten a significant traction. So right now they, they, are, they can already access all of the content as well as earn um, rewards. We are, we are going to be implementing this solution on the Algorand blockchain at the end of the quarter. And we have also started the second use case, which is uh, uh, digital collectibles, non-fungible tokens, where we really want to disrupt the digital advertisement um, model, as well as creating the direct relationship between brands, influencers, and users that we were discussing about. That's great. And, and maybe just, um, just for absolute simplicity, if you were just going to walk through the uh, use case and the steps that, that you're taking, um, I know that a lot of times it's blockchain can be a bit opaque in terms of people's ability to understand um, how it can be applied, but it might be interesting. I know this is a reward a viewer reward based system, but maybe talk just a little bit about that. Yeah, so basically users spend time on our platform giving us one of their most scarce resource, which is their time and their attention. And we give a value to that. Uh, obviously in terms, uh, given that we are an advertising model, we can literally give a proper real economy value to the time that they spend with us. And we share back to them some of these uh, some of these economics. Uh, the second the second leg to this is their social power and social networks. And so we want to achieve that network effect that blockchain allows by incentivizing them to bring uh, their social network onto the platform. Great. Well, Mario, you know this has been fantastic. Again, I can just speak for Algorand that we are thrilled to have you as a part of our community have Exponite there with the sort of vision and the tech forward uh, approach to leveraging new technology, I think uh, certainly is a testament to, to where you are and the opportunity is again just so enormous that uh, you know, we couldn't be happier to play a, a small part in, in trying to help you uh, achieve this uh, very, very large vision. Uh, and so thank you for your time today and uh, look forward to working with you closely over the years to come. Well, thank you very much, Sean. Uh, and likewise, uh, we look forward to what's uh, to come and to working with Algram for a very long time.